Hello my viewers, I welcome you to Automotive TV, the home of real technology. I'm engineer Lama Kilaja. Uh, we want to educate ourselves on uh, matters pertaining the automotive industry. Previously we've been looking into vehicle models and vehicle marks. And now we would like to look into the systems of which help this vehicle to move along the roads and convey us or just make us to navigate the earth. So today we commence from uh, the system which is so crucial known as the vehicle fuel system. Sometimes people may wonder we people just are feeding their vehicles as human beings do with a liquid like uh, liquid like uh, substance that is what we call fuel and we will ask ourselves where does this liquid being used so today we will commence from the basics and then we will build this as we grow the system now we commence from defining the term vehicle fuel system where some uh, learned fellows define as the system that comprises components that deliver fuel from the tank to the engine. Uh, in the near future, we'll just have a look at the how the engine looks like, how the tank looks like. So this, this vehicle fuel system has the components that deliver fuel from the tank where it is being stored to the engine where it is being used. So in this system, we have uh, three key words as we have defined it, vehicle, fuel, and system. So before we can go deeper, let us have a, a, a glimpse of what we call vehicle, what's a vehicle, what is fuel, and what is a system. So as we commence, we can have a look at uh, the vehicle. A vehicle you can be defined as a machine, which is usually wheeled and as an engine used for transporting people or goods on land. That's a vehicle. So we cannot call something that flies like uh, an aeroplane. We call it a vehicle. No, we can't do it. So the vehicle is a machine that has wheels and an engine used in transporting or conveying people or goods. And what about fuel? Fuel, we can say this is a substance that is used to provide heat or power. So a liquid like substance or a gas like substance because some vehicles use LPG meaning liquefied petroleum gas LPG so some vehicles can use LPG that is gas like substance and uh, others can use liquid like substance for example petrol and diesel sometimes you, they can use even a uh, uh, let me say it's, uh, but uh, not really vehicles use cruising but we don't have a car or a vehicle which uses cruising so that is the meaning of the term fuel. And what about a system? We say a system, this is a combination of components that work in harmony to bring a desired result. So like for example, in a human body, we have various systems. For example, we have a breathing system. This breathing system has components, organs. I mean now in, in human beings, we have organs. For example, we have the nose, we have the trachea, we have the lungs. These organs just work in harmony to bring a desired result of just enabling us to be irated for us to live. That is the same case that happens in a vehicle. So in fuel vehicle fuel system, we must have a tank, a fuel tank, uh, a fuel line, uh, injectors, 
throat or body for example and uh, the engine so these components just work hand in hand to how to produce a desired result so after looking into the meaning of the word vehicle fuel and system now we are supposed to go back to the business of the day the vehicle fuel system we said the vehicle fuel system it comprises the component that deliver fuel from the tank to the engine so these components include the fuel pump fuel lines fuel pressure regulator fuel filter and fuel injectors so after knowing the components that comprise this system then we're supposed to go have a little look into the types of fuel system then we call it a business of today afterwards we will be coming later to see uh, these individual components they are des uh, design and their functions so in touching we have three types of fuel system number one we have electronic fuel injection that is EFI the latest we have the direct injection and number last we have carburetor which is almost going to obsolete to distinct because you find all the models of vehicles use this type of system lastly uh, let me define one of the one of the systems before we call it uh, uh, a show uh, electronic fuel injection that is EFI so EFI this is a category of several different types of systems that are controlled electronically so these systems are more than four we will be having a look at them so otherwise this is the end of today's lesson we need to learn more on this because this is so crucial to have in a vehicle at least thank you for just joining with me in this automotive tv i welcome you again to the home of real technology my name is engineer lamek elijah goodbye